Hey my loves, so this time I'm doing a bit of a different review. Um, I've got these gorgeous little items from Femme Lux um, that I actually wanted to do a review about. Oh, my hand looks quite big there. Um, that I actually wanted to do a review about. Um, I'm doing a half video slash half written blog because I thought, well, why not? Let's switch it up from hosiery for a change. Um, most of these, actually three out of four items I'll be pairing with hosiery, like that top green one. I doubt I will, but... I will try my best to. So just give like give you a quick lowdown. I've actually got a black slinky off the shoulder belted jumpsuit. Um, that's in the top corner over there. I've got to read off this sheet. Um, I've got a black PU high split midi skirt, which is bottom. I've got the wine leather look corset crop bralette, which is obviously that wine colour there. It's so nice. And then lastly, I've got the khaki crop jumper loungewear set. So that's what I mean, isn't it? It'd be quite hard to do hosiery with it. But then again, me being me, I'll find hosiery to just pair with everything. So it'll be pretty fun. So I want to do a couple of um, unwrapping videos now just to show you what it looks like. And then we can get reviewing. Hey again. So I thought I'd put my face in the video this time. Seeing as I'm probably going to get some comments saying, oh, why are you not in the video? Oh, so um, I thought I would unwrap all the items that I've actually got. So I'm going to start off with the um, wine bralette corset. I feel like it's more of a corset than it is a bralette. So that's what we're working with. I'll do some more, obviously, up close images um, like I normally do on my blog anyway. But I just wanted to show you guys. What we're working with so that's what this one looks like this is kind of nice I'm, I'm not gonna lie i'm just hoping to god it fits that's one thing i hate is when you get clothing especially from a company you haven't done before and it just doesn't fit it's either too tight or too loose or it just looks so odd and you think why can't i be that model so yeah so i'm hoping fingers crossed um, second is the khaki two-piece i've always wanted to do a two-piece loungewear set i've just never found a nice enough one to do before so this time i thought oh do you know what i've got a thing for khaki at the moment because i rarely wear khaki or have anything khaki in my wardrobe so i thought this would be a good idea to make us start wearing khaki so these are the really cool comfy bottoms they actually have little po yeah the little pockets um with obviously a cuff bottom quite nice to touch actually i'm not gonna lie it's in quite decent quality as well, which is nice. I hate it when you get something, it looks amazing, but it comes and it just feels and looks cheap. I can't say this is the case here because these actually like are quite nice. And then this is the crop top, sort of like V-neck front and back with cuffed sleeves and the cuff bottom as well. This looks kind of cozy, I'm not going to lie. And you know what thing I really like as well when they have like a certain bit of bagginess to them. Like as much as I love like my body cons and my fitted tops, I kind of like being in baggier clothing now and again, just because it also helps. Especially like when you're sort when you're slim, it helps to um, really make your figure pop now and again. I've noticed maybe not all the time. Sometimes I just look like a sack. So I swear, I really look like a sack. But sometimes it actually like it, it can make it look quite nice. You know, maybe. Some people should give it a go. If not, then just send it my way. I'll happily wear it. Um, so that item is the PU Midi Leather Skirt. Now, I, I love leather skirts, I'm not going to lie. There's something about them. Just, oh, I love them. So, okay. So this is quite long. It looks kind of greeny there, doesn't it? Yeah. This, this is fully black, by the way. Let me just say, it is fully black. As much as I'm wishing it was khaki. <laughs> so... This is the skirt, so it is quite long. Like, oh, there we go. Oh, there's a massive split, like a huge split in it as well. So this would be quite nice. And it also does come with a belt as well. Thank God, because I was gonna say, I don't think I have any like PU belts to go with anything. And then this one, I was really intrigued about when I saw it online. So this is the um, jumpsuit. I've got a love-hate relationship with jumpsuits, I have to admit. I have got a couple, I rarely wear them. I love the look of them, but for me to actually get in one and like it, it, it takes a long time. Like, I have to change out of my outfit at least 10 times before I put it back on again. It's like, yeah, I'm happy with it now. So this one, 
is all right belt comes separate i was like oh my god where's the belt at first this is quite long so i'm gonna have to like probably push myself back but it's quite slinky so this is i don't know if you can see there but this is basically one that is gonna really hug you i don't know how i feel about it yet i'm kind of excited <laughs> so you can probably see the belt loops here oh my god here oh my god is that gone blurry ah, there we go yeah so you've also got cuff sleeves as well which is a bonus and literally you have cuff bottoms as well and oh my god why does this keep going blurry there we go <sighs> so yeah so this would be quite nice actually i'm not gonna lie to move myself all the way back yeah i feel Actually, do you know it would be quite nice because even though this does seem quite long on me because I'm a shorty, I hate having to admit the fact that I'm like quite short. So it'll be quite nice actually because because of the cuff bottoms, I can easily um, ruche them up the leg. So rather than have it just a straight and it's just all like oh, crumpled at the bottom making me look short like without even having to try, I might actually just do something on the legs just to basically make it look nice. So yeah, so those are the four items I'm actually going to be doing. It's gonna, it's gonna be really fun. I'm kind of not looking forward to this already. Yay! Hey loves. So this is, I'm going to be cut out a little bit, by the way, just so you know. Um, so this is the midi skirt that I'm trying on. Um, I have to admit, this is actually like full length. To be honest. Um, on me it's really nice though i have to admit it's a gorgeous fit um i need to iron it a little bit though i have to admit but it is really nice like it fits around the waist really well like you've got a little bit of stretch obviously i've tied it quite tight on my waist but you have a fair bit of stretch in it um and it it does slightly fold up a little bit like there so you might need to keep tugging down just a couple of times but one thing I do love, I thought the split was actually at the back. It's actually at the front, which is quite a nice size. It's like mid thigh range. Um, so it's not too exposing, but it's not too like fuddy duddy either if it's like down here or something. But I have to admit, I love it. It's such a nice material. It cleans really, really well. Um, it looks absolutely gorgeous on. Obviously, like I said, I need to give it a bit of an iron. Um, but otherwise, it is really, really lovely. Um, especially the inner material. It's like a really soft material. Um, actually, let me just show you guys a little bit closer. But that's the inner material. So it is nothing that would irritate your leg or like catch onto hosiery quite easily or anything. But I think it's such a lovely fit. And it actually, it actually looks really, really nice on as well. Um, obviously, you can style this up or down. I've kind of done it um smart cash let's say so i've added like a crop top um obviously with my skirt and i've also added these cute heels um you can obviously like to be honest i could easily pair these with like a pair of pumps um a pair of like sandals just if i want to just go walking around in town or something um you could easily do um ankle boots a bit daring to do thigh high boots but it could easily be done um, if you want to be a bit more conservative yet quite sassy. Um, so these are really nice. I really like them. Out of 10, I'll probably say an 8. Purely just because um, they're not midi. They're kind of more full then, if you know what I mean. Well, actually, have, have a look at the image reflection. It might be easier just to do that. But yeah, I'll probably say this is a full length skirt on me rather than a midi that it's been classed as. But otherwise you like um this is outfit number two the khaki two-piece loungewear set with a crop top um by the way before i forget check out the um reflection side of things as well because that can help not in a perverted way but just you can obviously see like bits that i might not be able to show you close up um so i've got to say this is so comfortable i love joggers like these oh my god they are so nice they're so comfortable they're like roomy so they're not fully like fitted to your legs um i love this scrunch effect that's going on here um and the cuff bottoms really do help 
Um, they are slightly, they've got a little bit of stretch in them, not a lot. Um, but because they're fabric, it's not too bad. Um, obviously no pockets on the back or anything. Just short ones at the front. As you can see, my hand can't fully go in. Um, but that's not an issue. The tie is just a decorative piece only. I normally leave mine like this, but you can always bow it if you really want. Um, let me just show you the top. So the top is pretty much, you can kind of have it off your shoulders. You can kind of have it slouching like this, but it depends really. Um, to be fair, I normally tend to wear like my jumpers like this, just because I'm all, I've am i always got something to do. So my sleeves are always rolled up. Um, so this kind of makes it, slightly baggier but you've got that whole draped effect you've got the whole bagginess effect so it's basically it's really nice what i'm trying to say is i quite like this i love the way it fits um it's actually really nice it doesn't irritate your skin or anything it's not that really cheap horrible material that you get either it's actually pretty decent which is nice it's not actually the top um like what you would get in Zara or like All Saints or something. Um, but it is still just as good, which I really like. Um, and it's affordable too. So that's obviously the front. Um, the back pretty much has the same kind of design. Like just that drop V um, and whatnot. But otherwise, I'm really liking this. And like the nice thing about these is you can either have them high up like here. So it smooths out the legs a little bit. I love mine dropped, I just like mine dropped because it's easier, but you have the leeway to do so. Um, and what I would like to say the same as a crop top, but that pretty much just stays in this section here. Literally, it's just underneath like your bra, like your bra line just here. Um, but it's still comfortable at the end of the day, which I really like. Oh, let me show you the shoes I've had. So normally, I'm this type of girl. I always end up pairing heels with these type of outfits. Um, but I quite like it though. I'm liking this. So, out of 10, I'm saying a 9. I say 9. Just because it's just so nice. You can dress it up or down. I could literally just add a choker, add a couple of bangles, um, probably do my hair in like a pony or something. Obviously, add some makeup because I'm makeup free at the moment. Um, and literally, there you go. I've already glammed up the outfit without even trying. Or you can literally just add some hoops, put on some pumps. And there you go again, it's still sort of like a smart casual kind of look, but you're not too casual, if that makes sense. Um, but either way, I like it. Hey beauts, right, outfit number three is the belted jumpsuit. The really nice clingy one that I'm loving, by the way, let me just say. Um, so I've paired them with these beauts. Okay, wait, let me give you a bit of a better look because these are new and I absolutely love them. They're so nice, so colourful, so pretty. So, um, I've got to say, this is really nice. Now, they're not as um, clingy as you would expect them to be. I still have room, if you can see. So there is that slight bit of bagginess to them, which is really nice. Um, down the lower leg, these are really like fitted. They're not, um, they haven't got their own cuff, as you can see just here, but I've given them like a really nice like ruche effect on the legs. Um, because remember I said obviously about me being short, so it's worked really really well actually. So I've got that going up to my calf, and then here it's it's quite nice and baggy, but not too fitted. So you've got like a full outline of everything. Um, how's that gone, blurry? Oh no, it's still good. Okay, and then the top half, basically you can do this however you like. So here, obviously I've rolled up the sleeves. Let me put them down. That's what it would be. Probably like squatting and everything. Okay, do you know what? Let me just move closer. Right. This is a bit better now. So, as you can see, you can literally have it like this. You can just keep it on top of your shoulders. You can... I've got to like maneuver everything. You can literally do it one-shouldered. You can even roll these up. And because these are cuffed, they will stay as well. So, it, do you know what? It's really nice because it's a really nice um, multi-way item. I like to call it and then you can do the belt however you want um now the only thing is obviously because the belt's quite thin and the hoops are really big you can actually switch belt um i've actually got a couple of big ones that i could easily wear with these with no issue whatsoever but i thought i'd give it a go with just the normal one um i've got to say i really do like them they are really really nice really nice and comfy um i probably wouldn't wear these in 
mega mega heat purely because these will really cling to you like i can just imagine this completely stick to me and look horrible um so i'm just gonna say they're they're lovely and you know what? i quite like this whole bat wing effect because it's still there a little bit but when you push it up more it's it's really nice i love stuff like that because it just makes it kind of nice relaxed kind of casual but like i say like you can easily dress this up i could wear these with a pair of like converses um just a pair of like open toe sandals like flat ones um obviously i'll pair it with heels um there's loads of different ways that you can actually wear this which i really really like that's one thing i love about my wardrobe is i like to have it versatile even if something is so dressy i like to tone it down i like to glam it up even more and it's it's just nice because you can get to wear it so many different ways then it's not just oh this is just a going out outfit and that's it i can't wear it for any other occasion maybe me i'll wear it for work put it that way i will wear this to work but i love them so out of 10 let's do a nine i like a nine here nine is good good quality really nice fit um you can style it so many different ways yeah we're doing the nine last but not least is the corset slash bralette type top um so this time i've actually paired it I could have done it with hosiery, but I didn't in the end. Um, because I wanted to go for a bit more of a casually kind of outfit. So I've actually paired it with my um crop jeggings and added some pumps um instead. Just I wanted to keep it like a little bit more casual. I know I get that this is quite a dressy top. Um, so I kind of wanted to flip it a little bit if that made sense. I'm trying to get comfortable now. Um, so as you see, it is quite fitted. I'm not gonna lie. I kind of probably need to add in a separate set of hooks or something into these. Um, just purely because it, I probably might need a size 8 in this instead of a size 6. I just thought, in terms of sizing, you just never know, do you? So the front fits quite well. Um, you've obviously got padded cups inside, so it helps. So if you choose to still wear a bra, that's fine. If you don't, that's fine too. Um, you've got, there is no um, piping or anything in this. It literally just is floopy material so it will kind of like mold to you rather than sit straight and that's it um around the back oh i really want to show you because it looks horrible but um basically as you can see it's getting stretched out just a tad bit um but like i said obviously i'll probably need a size eight rather than a size six in this but either way it, it still is really nice i keep pulling it up i'm just so conscious it's going to fall straight down um but otherwise it's actually um really quite nice can you see how it kind of changes color as well like here it looks quite dark but when i move forward it suddenly goes slightly lighter so just bear that in mind when you wear this during the day and in the evening that it can slightly change its tone um otherwise this is a really nice top otherwise i quite like it and i feel it if i've got a size eight it might be a little bit better but like i said you just don't know do you really until you try but um that's the only thing that's bothering me is this whole being stretched out here at the back rather than having like a flush fit you probably get it like if i just tuck it down like that but hey ho um otherwise it's really nice i quite like it and this is something i could easily like put a shirt on top of um or maybe just pop a cardi on top or if it's obviously a really nice day if i'm going out i will just leave it as it is um so yeah, there's so many ways that you could work this top. Um, skirts would be kind of careful with because you just don't want it to look a bit pro like provocative. You still want it to dress it quite nice. So I'd probably say like midi skirts um, or like low thigh skirts. So they sit like here rather than all the way up here kind of thing. But otherwise, it's quite nice. I love the colour though. The colour's got to be one of my favourite things. Like it's so nice. I really love it. Um, rate right out of 10, I'll probably say 7. Purely because of the fit, I think. I mean, if the fit was better, I'll, I'll probably give that about an 8. 8, I would say. Yeah. But otherwise, I'm pretty happy with it. It's so really nice. I'm glad I gave it a go. Yay!